Stan Jebelisco here. A little more about the emitter follower circuit, a couple of alternative ways to build an emitter follower. Uh, in the first video, I showed you an NPN bipolar transistor with a negative power supply voltage. Well, negative power supply voltage is generally not found in most equipment today you will usually find a positive supply instead. So you can alternatively build your emitter follower like this. Input, output, plus 12 volts, and rather than directly ground the collector, you ground the collector for signal using a large value capacitor, large enough to short the signal to ground and particularly if it's a radio frequency signal that shouldn't be hard to do and then these resistors can provide the bias. This is actually a circuit from my book Teach Yourself Electricity and Electronics the emitter follower using an NPN bipolar transistor. But we do have another alternative similar to the uh, circuit in the first video that I made on this topic where you do directly ground the collector but instead of an NPN transistor, you use a PNP transistor so that you can uh, work the circuit from a plus 12 volt supply like this. You actually connect the positive supply voltage to your emitter. These resistors provide the bias for class A operation where the signal flows for the entire input cycle along the straight line portion of the characteristic curve and you have a radio frequency input and output and this type of circuit will work actually over a broader range of frequencies because you don't need to worry about the value of a capacitor shorting the collector to ground so that is a those are a couple of alternatives this from teach yourself electricity and electronics fifth edition uh, I don't recall exactly which chapter it's in now, but I lifted it from that book. That is a good book to get, by the way, and I will provide a link to that book in the description of this video. You can learn about this and many other topics in that book. But this circuit using an NPN transistor will allow you to operate a common collector or emitter follower with a positive supply voltage. And so will this alternative, which is just like the circuit that I showed you in the first video, except it uses a PNP rather than an NPN transistor. Stan Jibalisco, signing off for now from the far reaches of Saturn's kingdom. Until next time, so long.